So now you're ready to make your post for week four. So what you're going to do is you're going to go in and you're going to create a thread just like what you've done in all the previous weeks. And when it opens up, again, remember, it's going to give you the entire description from the previous page. And what you're going to do is you're going to scroll down, you're going to give it that catchy title so that it makes me want to read your posting before I read anybody else's posting. Uh, when you come down in here, the first thing you may want to do is just go ahead and tell me that, you know, here's my, here's my Google Doc with my images. So, And so like most of you, what you're going to do is you're going to do a control V on a PC and looky there, there's my, my link. The problem is this is not a clickable link. I want it to be so that when I read your post and all of your classmates read your posting, they just click on it and then boom, it just opens up like amazing. So what you're going to do is you highlight what you just pasted on there. So there's your URL. You're going to highlight it. You're going to click on this link. So that's to insert your link. You get this window when you click on the link button. So it says you want your link path. So what the link path is, it's what you just pasted. So you're going to paste it in here again. Now, for the target, you want to make this open in a new window. And then you're going to click Insert. Now, when you did that, notice what happened to what you'd originally pasted. Now it's blue and it's underlined. So now this is a clickable link. So you can press Enter, and then you can actually begin the rest of your posting with your examples and everything else and discussions and then remember at the very end don't forget to click submit that's how we're all going to read it so i look forward to your postings and your images this week